Hi, I'm Pat Donovan Potts, the Stormwater Manager with the City of Jacksonville. This year for the State of the River Address, we would like to identify common household hazards that could potentially pollute a watershed that you use every single day. So with this State of the River Address, let's take a look at what we do every day. For instance, we drive to work. We've got to have a vehicle that operates. One of the things that helps it last longer is to actually conduct maintenance. Whether it's an oil change and uh, with a filter, uh, checking your antifreeze, checking all of the fluids, topping them off. Our weekend warriors that uh, actually work on their vehicles. If you are able to work on your vehicle, there's a right way and a wrong way to change your oil. If you're doing it in the driveway, please make sure that you use an oil pan or a drip pan underneath. After completing the task, please take the oil and pull it, pour it back into the container where we can actually take it to some of our local uh, gas stations and recycle it. What you don't want to do is leave the oil pan out. If it happens to rain overnight, the oil pan will fill up with water, thus pushing the oil to the top, it will spill over and then down the driveway. Most of our driveways are attached to roads. On the side of the road are catch basins. These catch basins uh, connect to an underground piping system that leads directly to the new river. So the oil that should have been back in the container but was left inadvertently, only a few drops of oil to contaminate gallons and gallons of water. And our watershed is extremely important. If you do have a few drips that missed the oil pan, please do not pull out the water hose. You don't want to spray and spread that oil down the driveway and again, putting it into the nearest storm drain. Instead, take some kitty litter or some dry chem. You put it on to the actual spot. You sort of crush it in with your foot. And then what you want to do is just sweep it up. When sweeping it up, you then want to put it into a bag and take it to the landfill where they will take hazardous materials. So everybody's backyard counts. Every citizen counts. Unattended consequences may impact the new river.